Isaiah 33, verse 16. And he shall dwell on high. His place of defense shall be the munitions of the rocks. Bread shall be given him. His water shall be sure. Thine eyes shall see the king in his beauty, and they shall behold the land that is very far off. The Bible tells us that God is going to take care of us. God is going to defend us. God is going to give us bread and water. And God is going to allow us to see how beautiful that he really is. And he's going to give us vision that's far beyond what we can do for ourselves. Hi, I'm Craig Fritchley with the Sanctuary in Syracuse, Indiana, with today's devotional. And as another day dawns, and the beauty of the fall is, is enveloping all around us, it is amazing that people can choose to focus on the negative and miss the beautiful things that God has given. Yes, I know there's trouble all around. Yes, there's confusion. The devil loves for there to be confusions in the, confusion in the mind and the hearts of people. God is not the author of confusion. God gives us his word. He gives us his plan. He gives us his spirit. And he wants us to see far beyond what we can see normally. So I challenge you today, focus on the beauty of God. Look full in his face. Get alone with God and hear his voice. And allow the Spirit of God to lead you and guide you. Isaiah chapter 6, verse number 1. The Bible says, In the year the king Uzziah died, I saw the Lord sitting upon a throne, high and lifted up and his train filled the temple. Isaiah said there was political changes in leadership. Uzziah was a good king, and now we did, he didn't know how it was going to all work out with the next king. And in the midst of that time, Isaiah saw the Lord. Look at the Lord. Look to him for your direction. Look to him for your guidance, because God gives us everything that we need. He's taking care of our world, and he's putting a reflection of himself in the beauty all around us in nature. God's a great God, and God cares for you very much. And so look at the king, because the king today is full of beauty. He's an awesome God, and he's worthy to be praised. God bless you. Share these with others, and we hope you join us for our next daily devotional.